This game is rated M for some really, really kooky stuff. Viewer discretion is advised. Right, before we check out the apartment, let's let's see if we can go in here. Oh my god, it's the washroom. I don't feel like washing my face right now. And apparently we have no reflection. None at all. Is that the same thing or? Yeah, that's the same thing. Nothing to do here. Well, how about if you need to take a leak, man? It's just a normal bathroom. Nothing has changed since I moved here two years ago. So you've been here for two years. I don't feel like taking a shower right now. Okay. Ooh, there's a little cubby. Ooh, it's a little cubby. It's just the typical stuff you find around sink. Nothing particular interesting. Really? Mm. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Anyway. Let's... Yeah, let's go in here. Yeah, there's a lot of tools and things around the ground. Got a tank full of oil. Clothes dryer. And a washer. And nothing interesting at the moment, but yeah, this is this is kind of one sweet apartment. Holy cow. It has a washer dryer. Wow, that's pretty neat. But I have to say what's not neat is five days ago since when I first had the nightmares. I haven't been able to get out of my room since. My phone doesn't work. The TV doesn't work. Jack is not a, not a happy man. My whole life has suddenly turned around. The door is chained out. The window is shield shut. And on top of that, someone chained the door from the inside. How am I going to get out of here? Don't go out, Walter. What the hell? What's Catchphrase? Going on here? It's Eileen Gavin from the next door. Oh man. I hope my luck changes before the party. Just... Oh, you were you a butterfingers? You got it all over the wall there. Mm, might want to clean that up since the, before the superintendent comes. Just saying. Anyway, let's uh, let's check out here. What's this? Mom, why don't you wake up? Why doesn't you wake up? Put the first letter in the scrapbook. How you know it's the first? It could be the second or the fifty-second one. Shoes. My shoes. You only have one pair of shoes. Two pairs of shoes. Ooh, fridge. And it's not gross. Sweet. There's chocolate milk in here. Sure, I can take some chocolate milk. Chocolate milk. Chocolate favored milk. Very sweet. It was in the refrigerator at home, which I probably should put back in there because it's milk. But I'm not. White wine. Want to take a bottle of white wine? Sure, let's go get... Let's milk... The, let's let's do some chemistry here. Cocktails. Buying a white wine from the refrigerator. Break eventually if I keep on using it as a weapon. Oh. I thought it was going to make cocktails. Chocolate milk cocktails. I guess not. Oh well.
Was it me or were there footprints here? I could have swear I saw footprints here. Like right here. Wait a minute, let's open that fridge again. Yeah, there's footprints there. It's right there. I'm pointing at the screen. Can you see it? It's right there. That's curious. That's yeah, interesting. Don't feel like washing my hands right now? Well, it's better looking than the actual sink that you had in your dreams, so... Thank the heavens for that. Really don't feel like cooking now? Boop, 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 boop. Trash can? No, nothing about the trash can. That photo is me as a kid, and when I graduated from high school. Dynamite. I've had this furniture since before I moved in here two years ago. The main power is off. Even if I press it, nothing happens. No, my TV's wasted. Wasted. I got this photo from Frank Sunderland, the superhero at South Ashfield Heights. Sunderland. That name sounds familiar. This photo is from just outside South Ashfield Heights. I was immediately attracted by the outside of the building, as well as the view from the window here. I moved in here two years ago and felt like I was being drawn here. Well, seems like you can't leave now. Hope you hope you enjoy it. What's this? Looks like a scrap from a book. Man, this thing has been written ages ago. Through the ritual of the Holy Assumption, he built a world. It exists in a space separate from the world of our Lord. More accurately, it is within, yet without, the Lord's world. Unlike the world of our Lord, it is a world in extreme flux. Unexpected doors or walls, moving floors, odd creatures, a world only he can control. Anyone swallowed up by that world will live there for eternity, undying. They will haunt that realm as a spirit. How could our Lord forgive such an abomination? This part of the book was too damaged to read. It is important to travel lightly in that world. He who carries too heavy a burden will regret it. The book is too damaged to read from here. What does it mean? Well, we'll find out later. So we can actually look out here also. What is that person doing down there? I'm wondering. Again, I'm pointing to the screen like you can see me. And there's... Looks like someone playing Wii, but this is before the Wii came out. Ooh, nifty. Ooh. All right. Anything on the radio? And now the news. In Washington, a gathering of 200,000 people appealing for stricter gun control laws in the wake of a spate of violent shootings throughout the country turned tragic when shots were fired into the crowd. Two people were killed and several wounded, including a three-year-old child. At this moment, no suspects have been found. Police are investigating the source of the shots. Okay. And that's what it normally is. The clock stopped working a few days ago. Okay. It's weird. A few days ago, the power to my TV and VCR just stopped coming on. Ever since I started having those nightmares. 
Well, you might want to check the outlet because everything else seems to be working. Your lights seem to be working absolutely fine. Yeah, it's definitely something. Anyway, this chest could hold a lot of stuff. Indeed it can. It's our chest. It's like a Resident Evil chest, basically. So, don't need the bottle of wine, don't need the chocolate milk, so... Yes, let's store our chocolate milk in the chest instead of the refrigerator. Go figure. I don't know. Excuse me? Exactly. I was going to say that, but... Henry beat me to the punch. Anyway, before we go check out that big bang, let's go over to this red book and save. Room 302. All right, let's go check out that big bang. Let's go check it out. Okay, I think we have termites. Or ants, maybe? What or... The hell? Maybe it's Andy to frame. Is somebody in there? I just hope they, uh, that doesn't lead to a sewer pipe. I wonder if I can get out this way. Well, it worked for Andy, so why not? Let's go for it. Seeing that we can't get out the front door, let's go out the door. Oh, and there's even a sewer pipe there. Perfect. Let's go. Uh, sure. Ooh, we got a steel pipe. Ooh, three foot long sewer pipe. Not powerful, but easy to use. And that's really creepy. It sounds like children in there. I think I'm going to go back to bed. Okay. <laughs> yes, we'll have to enter the hole. The creepy hole. Well, that's certainly interesting. Now, we have to actually go forward here. Like, I'm physically going forward. I'm pressing the, the forward button on this. But it's tedious. But I forgot, it's Silent Hill. You do tedious stuff all the time. So, yeah. Thank God that you don't have to do this every single time you go through the hole. So, bonus points. Oh no, the light, it burns, it burns, it burns.